got you, baby. I got you. Walker. We have a 10 inch mega bass high slide. Look at that. Just like that. Freaking tank. Oh my god. Oh. Front door. Wow. What a rainy day out here today. The truck right here outside. We're about to go have a little journey today. All right, get the fishing rods on deck. Got the hat. Got the old camera. The vlog camera's in my hand. I think we're ready to go. Woo. Got my camera a little foggy here. Hope everybody's having a good day. Today, uh, we're actually going to, I'm heading to Walmart right now. That's my, that's my first little uh, thing that I gotta go do. And I'm gonna be picking up a little bait because I've got a cool video for you guys today. Isaac, uh, I'm meeting up with him right now. He's actually been throwing some massive, massive, massive swim baits recently. And yesterday he actually caught, I believe, a six and an eight. We're actually going to a different location today. And he's going to be throwing that giant swim bait. It's like $150. Guys, this guy is crazy. Like, he literally throws baits that could pay people's rent. He literally throws baits in the water that any fish could break off at any point in time. And he doesn't care. He, he said he broke off, like, a $120 bait last week. He broke off a couple standard baits this week. This guy has some some expensive swim baits. So he says he's gonna be chucking a $150 one today. And I was like, why not do a cheap versus expensive challenge? So we're actually gonna run the Walmart real quick and I'm gonna pick up a little swim bait. As you guys can tell, at the old Walmart, Isaac's right there, got his truck right there. You won't believe what he just showed me. And it, you guys are gonna see it here in a minute. He's got some serious baits, guys, I'm telling you. He's, I mean, serious stuff, some some expensive lures, but we're gonna be going in here. I haven't thrown swim baits much. I'm gonna throw something big today. I wanna catch some on a big swim bait because he's always talking about it. He's always catching big fish. So we're gonna do that as well, but I am gonna go in here and see if I can find some, some more inexpensive lures as well that we can use. This is what we got. We have some of the saltwater selection. Then you got some of the standard ones over there. I'm trying to figure out what we should get. I mean, you got these, which are pretty much only $4 for four of them. So it's a dollar a pop, same with those. Just the colors. I mean, they have these. I was looking at these, you got three, you got four for $3. That's literally less than a dollar a pop. And those don't look bad. I might have to go with these. I might get another pack as well though. So you have all these storms right here. These are all like the freshwater ones. I don't know. I kind of like that one. I just don't know if, we could either go with that or we could go with something like this. That's not bad. Which like thing? And that peg is empty. It means something. Oh, you want this? That peg's empty. So it's, saying it's a live crappy. crappy. Yep. There it is. It's right there. Yeah, That's will. the same one. Mm -hmm. Remember when I caught... So the pond we went to, I actually caught a ton of crappie. I did. It was like back-to-back -back casts. So maybe, maybe we'll go with this one. I think Let's go with this one. These three right here. You got a trouble and you got the back hook as well. Five dollars for these three. It's pretty much a dollar a pop. We're gonna get these. Oh, Ugh. all right. So, we got the baits. Decided to go with these little crappie baits. They're literally only a dollar a pop. Literally only a dollar a pop right there. They don't look bad. I was gonna go with the saltwater ones, but I did catch like four crappie back to back casts at this place last time. That's got me a little monster to go. We're ready to go fish, guys. So I want you to comment below if you like this document style better, like me kind of vlogging the whole thing, like me doing the whole trip pretty much. Like say I'm going fishing, but I have to stop by Bass Pro Shops and grab a few things or I have to get my poles ready, this or this or that, whatever it is. If you guys like that style better, be sure to drop a like on this video and leave a comment below letting me know. And also I want you guys to comment below either the most expensive lure you've used or the cheapest. Comment below the price and what the bait is. Go do that right now. All right, I'm gonna stop mumbling. We're gonna stop talking. We're gonna stop vlogging. And we're gonna get over to the pond and hopefully catch some freaking toads. Thank you, sir. Of course, man. Shocks, brother. Yep. My shit's biting, man. You have a good day. Be safe. Thank you. All right, guys, this is what I'm talking about by saying that this guy 
is literally crazy. I mean, look at the <laughs> look at the baits that he has. So tell me, tell me what you're gonna catch on that, Isaac, because I know you're not gonna catch a bass. Well, we are gonna catch bass. Glide baits. We have the 10 inch um, Mega Bass Ice Slide, um, which is a uh, giant. Obviously, you gotta. Have I mean, right look tackle. at this compared to my hand. Lay, lay it in my hand. So you gotta have the right tackle. Guys, come on now. That is how much is this bait? Uh, probably say about 99 plus. Um, but really, would you pay 99 dollars to catch a 10 pound bass? Probably. Uh, this is a 200 version, eight inches. Uh, swims really good. Another back. So you want to rip this? It's a warden color. Looks like shad. Um, we also have a smaller version. Trout. So it's a 168s. This is my favorite one to use because in most places. You can always be safe with this size versus this size. 200, 168. Is that it? Thank you. Is that it? That's about it. Hopefully we can catch some and show you guys um, some fish on these things. Guys, I think this is so funny. Like I'm laughing about it, but I'm not I'm not lying to you. Like he actually catches fish on them, so I can't really laugh about it too much. What did you catch him on yesterday? I know he caught what, like an eight and a six yesterday? What which one was that? I'd rather leave that up to the viewers. Just comment below on Guess the video which one. And guess which one. So you got the bull shed. I don't even know all the names. One, two, three, four, five, or six. What do you think he caught? this fish on what did i tell you guys i mean the man's crazy he's actually not a human being he's actually a freaking animal like that guy's kind of scary he freaks me out if you ask me first things first we have to rig up walker what are you what are you tying on and then I got, speak up walker a little got bit a i'm not gonna buy it i promise you i promise 90 and rainbow trout let me see right there oh yeah and then I got a 168 in Warden. Cool, cool. That's the same one I got on, right? Is it? Yeah, same Yeah, it is the same one. one. This is actually one that Isaac let me use the other day. So I'm gonna be putting this on, and then the $1 Storm Crappie, because we gotta test these out, because since Isaac just ha has every swim bait in the world that's 50 bucks plus, we gotta show you know this $1 lure some love as well. So let's let's see what the man himself has, this crazy animal over here. Isaac's gonna love me after this video. <laughs> just these two, that's it for now. Look at that. Guys, that is a bait. Wow. So I'm, I have the same one on. What do you think is gonna get them today? Glide bait in a smaller size. Yeah. Um, hopefully we'll catch quantity, and once I get tired of those, I'm gonna go with the big boy to try to. Uh, I want to see. You have to catch one on this today. Yeah, I have to catch one on the dollar. Down on the I bottom, got you. So I hope we'll get bit on the bottom. Oh, cool. All right, guys, we're getting this video started right now. We're about to start fishing. I hope you guys are enjoying this. Kind of like the document, like just documenting the whole trip and kind of explaining more in the videos, making the videos a little bit longer. If you guys enjoy that, be sure to smash the like button and let me know below, but I'm gonna stop talking. Let's go catch some fish. So I got two choices right here. I'm pretty much gonna start off with the $1 one, the inexpensive one. See if I can get a bite. I don't, I don't know what's gonna happen. I've never, I don't really swim bait fish much. So this is interesting. This is Isaac's always wanting me to come do it. So I'm gonna try it. Oh, he just, there he is. Yeah. God, he's a pretty good one too. God, look at him. On the $1, he choked it too. He choked it in the back of his throat. Look at that. Guys, look at that right there. That is called choking it. $1 swim bait. This is the first fish of the day. But I can tell you one thing. If these guys get one hooked on that big swim bait, it's game over. I already know they're gonna they're gonna hook something massive. Like this is a good, decent little fish right here. There's nothing wrong with this fish, it's beautiful. But at the same time, I already know if they hook one on that big swim bait, it could eat this fish. Let's get a release on her. First fish of the day. There she goes. All right, guys, a little rainy outside. We're kind of having to wait for it to blow off. Hopefully, it's not going to be bad. We're just going to have to keep watching it, obviously, just because of my camera gear in general. Let's see if we can get some over here. I'm just stopping. They're getting their stuff ready. Let's see if I can catch one real quick. Oh, he broke you off? What was that? No, what did he, what did he bite you on? What? He just broke you off like that? Oh, God, he's a freaking tank. This 
is he? He has a swim bait in his mouth? Dude, it's a freaking slaunch. He does, he does, he does. No, he doesn't. Oh, it's a different fish. Beautiful fish right here, fish number two, guys. Absolutely choked that swim bait. Isaac just broke a big one off in the same spot. We're gonna see if we can catch another one. Look at that beautiful bass right there. Nothing wrong with that one. Rainy day, clouds everywhere, winds whipping. But look at that beautiful fish. Let's go, baby. That's probably the ones that I saw that one day. You got him? Another one? Oh my gosh. Walker's hooked up with a freaking slaunch. Oh my grab god. It, grab it, grab it. Grab it, grab it, grab it. You got it. I got you, baby. I got you. <laughs> Walker. <laughs> Dude, he's got him a freaking donkey. You got him? Give him a hug. Look at that, Walker's got a slaunch freaking tank. Look at that fish, bro. Look at that fish. Let me see, man, let me see. Absolutely choked the Senko. Walker's over here cheating, but if he's cheating and catching fish like that, I do not mind. Good job, bro, look at that thing. Oh, wow, yeah, look at his tail, guys. Wow. Dude, that's a freaking sweet fish, man. Oh my God, he came off. He freaking, oh my God. No, that was, that might've been the biggest fish of my life, dude. Well, look at the boil, look at the boil right there. Dude, that fish was freaking gigantic. Oh, he's hitting it. Did you see that? Yeah, I saw it. Dude, that was a freaking toad. Yeah, get, get, you take a picture and I'll see if I can hook this one. Yeah, but I mean, I'll run them like weightless, you know. You got one? Yeah. Is he big? There you go. Walker's hooked up. He's cheating again. I, I don't know about this guy. I don't know if I can come out here with him anymore. But that's still a good fish, man. Still a respectable little. He's healthy. A pretty little fish. Nothing, nothing big like a second ago, yeah. but it's a pretty fish. Nothing wrong with that one. Let's get a release on it. I don't know if I cast your top water real quick. It's too much crap in there and it keeps getting stuck on my hook. Just like that. Just like that. <laughs> I knew he was there. Ah, uh, nah, I got him. Choked it too. Guys, beautiful little fish. About two and a quarter. He's very thick, very healthy fish right here. Beautiful. Look at him. I actually picked up Isaac's top water just for a minute because I just knew there was one in that corner. There's a bunch of grass. It was getting on my swim bait. A couple plops later, got an old decent fish. Let's get him back in the water. Oh my gosh. Dude, he's huge too. I mean, he's a monster. Look how big he is, dude. I can't even move him. Oh my gosh. Dude, that's a freaking donk. Oh my gosh. You got him? Choked it too. Grip. Oh, he's barely hooked. <laughs> oh, oh no. Get him, get him. You got him? Oh, I should have grabbed him. Five. I got it on GoPro. God, what? Yes, yeah, on the one dollar swim bait. I'm not even mad, man. You watch him eat it. <laughs> Dang, that was a freaking donkey, dude. Tell us what's about to happen, Isaac. Have this hole. Oh, I think it's gonna go down. Uh, it's been a tough day, but we've had some good bites. We'll, we'll probably get him. Just gotta believe. What's your thoughts, Walker? What do you think, man? It's been a fun day. We had some trouble with the wind, or with the weather, but it ended up being a good move. We're about to get him here and finish up. Walker, come on now, eye contact. <laughs> your, your parents not teach you that. that, that's respect, man. There you go. Isaac's hooked up already. There you go, his first fish of the day. 
pretty little fish. Hold him up to the camera, man. Two Nothing monstrous, ago. but that like is, that's a beautiful, look at that, how stubby that fish is. A decent fish. That's awesome, man. Check him any day. Good job. Yep. Show us what you got, Walker. On the old Sanko. Little guy right there. Yeah, two pounds. Not bad. Not a bad fish, healthy little guy. On the little Sanko. Good job, man. All right, Isaac. So, what's what's your thoughts on the cheapest versus expensive swim bait challenge, man? Cheapest one. It was a good bait. Uh, the fish in these lakes eat crappie. We caught big crappie, so they did a great job. I don't know if it matters on price point, but I'm still gonna buy the expensive ones. But I'm also gonna buy some of the cheaper. And and don't let him fool you guys. He's been catching them on the big one, but what about you? What about you, Walker? Uh, the cheaper one definitely was worth listen don't listen to anything that he's saying because he's cheating he <laughs> cheated the whole day walker you're just disqualified man you can't be in my videos anymore i'm sorry everybody just go un unfollow his instagram matter of fact what's your instagram what's your name? go give him a follow isaac what's your instagram man? go ahead and go give them both a follow overall i hope you guys really enjoyed this video if you did you know what to do please hit that like button please comment below if you want to see more cheap versus expensive challenges because that was actually pretty fun today guys we got to experiment with some spinner uh spinner baits <laughs> swim baits and uh it was a blast i'm very surprised the one dollar one kicked the uh you know hundred dollar ones but because i'm being honest with you isaac has been smacking them on that and i promise you you know it could have a lot of reasonings. It could be because, you know, the bait's obviously a bigger profile. You know, the conditions are different. Maybe because we're at a pond, you know, if you put that thing on a lake, it would probably do a lot better. There's a bunch of different reasons on why that $1 swim bait. It's not, I'm not stating that that one's better than that one because all in all it isn't. But overall, it was still fun. It had a great time. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to like the video, hit the subscribe button, and also press the little bell next to that so to send you post notifications. But thank you guys so much for the support. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. I got sky like the weatherman, uh. I crack cars, get hella bears, uh. I got a bra from the motherland, uh. I got shooters with ass, uh. I get it, get it, uh. Anyway, uh. Pull up skirt in the hurricane, uh. I crack cars, cook every day, uh. I get money, uh. Every day, uh.